Gestapo is 20 kilometers west and 62 kilometers south of Rotorua. Now this is a map of New, uh, North Island of New Zealand. I'm talking about places in New Zealand. So this is Topo. This is Topo. This is Rotorua. And this is Fakatani. Okay, so you have an understanding of what I'm talking about. Topo is 20 kilometers west and 62 kilometers south of Rotorua. So this is a, you could draw a right angle triangle. So yeah, so let me use a so this is 20 kilometers to the west and 62 kilometers south from Rotorua. So this is 20 kilometers to the west and 62 kilometers south is Topo from Rotorua. Okay, what, is it, what else does it say? Fakatani, this is the place Fakatani, is 82 kilometers east. So let me use a different color. So this is 82 kilometers uh, this way to the right, that is east, and 12 kilometers to the north. So this is 12 kilometers. Okay, so this is your, this is Rotorua, which is 82 kilometers from, uh, 82 kilometers to the east and 12 kilometers north of Rotorua. Calculate the distance between Topo and Fakatan. So, so this is what we want to find. What's the distance between Topo to Fakatan? So let's draw a better diagram to understand what, so this is your x and y axis, and let's call this Rotorua is your, this is your reference point Rotorua, so let's call that R. Okay, so Topo is 20 kilometers to the uh, west, so you go 20 kilometers to the west and 62 kilometers south, so it is somewhere here. Yeah. This is Topo, T for Topo. So this is 20 year, 20 to the west. So this is north, this is east, uh, this is west, and this is south of Rotorua, because Rotorua is the reference point. So this is 62, this is 62. Fakatani is 82 kilometers, so this is say 82 not drawn to scale, and 12, say, comes here. This is 12 to the north, 12 kilometers north. So this point is, this point is Fakatani, W for Fakatani. So let me write east here. So this is your east from, this is your east, west, north, south. So the question is, what is the distance between Topo to Fakatani. So this is what we're asking. What's this distance? Okay. Now, to find the distance, so, uh, let me use a dotted line segment. So let us join these two points by joining a right angle triangle. So you can join this way. Anyway, it doesn't matter. So let me join like this. Okay. So yeah. If you want to find the distance, let's call that distance as D. The distance between Topo to Fakatani. Fakatani is D. So, to find the distance, there's a distance formula, but I don't like students to remember formula. To find the distance, you have to simply use Pythagoras theorem. Okay, so what is this distance? This is horizontal distance. Well, this is minus 20. So let me call this is minus 20. This is minus 62. This is plus 12. So the distance from, say, let's call this, say, P. Let's call this P. TP, the distance from T to P, the distance from this to this point is 20, and the distance from year to year, year is 82. So this is, say, 20, and this is 82. So the distance from T to P is 102. You just need to know how to add numbers. Okay, now what's the distance from P to W? Okay, the distance from P to this point is 62. This is 62 because this is minus 62. So from year to year is 62. So from year to year is also 62. And this is 12. So the distance from P to W is 62 plus 12, which is 74. Okay. 
So now using Pythagoras, using Pythagoras, Pythagoras, what can we say? D squared is equal to 102 squared plus 74 squared. 74 squared. So D squared, so let's get the calculator out. So when you run 102 squared plus 74 squared is how much? Is 15,880. 15,880. Now we want distance, not D squared. So to take the square root, so square root of D squared is equal to square root of 15,880. So your distance, that is the distance between Topo and Fakatani is the square root of 15,000. So you go shift square root of 15,880. And you want to round it to the nearest kilometer. So this is 126 kilometers. So to the nearest kilometer, the distance between Topo to Fakatani is 126 kilometers.